If you have a Windows 10 computer, and you don't have a recovery media such as DVD or USB recovery drive. I'll show you in few steps how to make one. What you will need, you'll need at least 16 gigs of storage flash drive. Plug it in into your computer and then click on start and go into control panel or type control panel and click enter. And right here, if you see categories like this, you can click view by, you can click on it and change it to large categories. Right here, we need to click on recovery. And right here you see create recovery drive. Click on it and in this pop-up box, leave everything as default and click next. And right here in this window, right here, this is your flash drive, the one we put in the computer. Then we need to click next right here. And it is just telling us that everything is gonna be deleted from the flash drive. So if you have any files that you need, save your files somewhere else because this flash drive will be formatted and then click create. That's it, now it's creating recovery drive. And this is gonna take a while. This could take up to one hour or hour and a half. Once the process is complete, Click on finish and now we can close everything. And now I'll show you how to use this recovery drive. Plug in your USB drive into the computer that you would like to recover. While pressing on the power button, we'll have to press on escape or F12 keys to boot into boot menu. It all depends on your computer. On my computer, Lenovo, it's F12. Power button and keep pressing F12 until you'll get to the boot menu. Once you get to the boot menu, we need to choose USB Kingston data. This is mine. Yours probably gonna call something else and then press enter. Once you get to the screen, choose your language. So there is a couple options what we can do. One of the options we can just recover from the drive, but this is gonna delete everything off of your computer and reinstall operation system. Or what we can do, we can click on troubleshoot. If we click on troubleshoot, there is a couple options. We can start up repair. It's gonna try to repair your computer on a startup. Then we can use uninstall updates. Uninstall updates, basically if uh, your system failed during the install updates, if it was installing one of the bigger updates or something and it did fail, so we can uninstall some of the updates. Then right here is a system restored option. It can restore back into the restore point. One of it was created earlier. And there's this option, system image. This option will try to recover into the system image if image is not corrupted itself. And also you can start with a command prompt for advanced troubleshooting. But if your computer is already running slow and you don't really have any files on it, and if you would just like to reinstall operation system, you can go back, you can click on recover from a drive. This will delete everything though, and it will reinstall Windows 10, so it's gonna be clean install. Hopefully this video was helpful to you guys. Thanks for watching.